Today marks Startup Day across America, and members of Congress are showing their support by promoting growing businesses within their district. Our news reporter Breon Martin joins us now from our newsroom with more on that. Breon. Congresswoman Louise Slaughter toured Simpor Incorporated today, highlighting their most recent federal funding. The Henrietta-based nanotechnology company designs and produces membranes and research in biomedicines. Since starting up in 2007, Simpor works towards creating small-scale dialysis systems and even developing filter-based systems designed to help maintain red blood cells. A new $975,000 award will go towards nanotechnology research. It's difficult to achieve what they're doing here. And it takes scientists like these who are beautifully trained, who are avid, and they're so uh, interested in what they're doing. I'd be surprised if they take time to sleep. But what they're doing is going to make such a change in this country. Just imagine it. If you're a dialysis patient, and instead of going and be strapped to a chair for four or five hours, uh, three times a week, uh, you just have a thing on your arm that can work continuously for you. That's magnificent. Many large companies would find the same development investment opportunity too risky. So the federal funds for small businesses are critical for filling this gap. The company says it's working on technology that could supplement sources of red blood cells in large quantities.